We're following up on a deadly assault at Portland International Raceway last month. Michael Taylor is accused of manslaughter for punching Anthony Mancuso, who then fell to his death. Brent Weisberg was in court this morning to learn more. Michael Eugene Taylor turned himself into the sheriff's office, and today he made his first court appearance. Meanwhile, friends and family say there is absolutely another side to this story. This investigation started July 9th. Portland police say that Taylor and a man named Anthony Mancuso got into a fight at Portland International Raceway. That fight got physical, and according to investigators, Taylor punched Mancuso, who went down and hit his head. That caused a brain injury, and Mancuso died. The case was then reviewed by a grand jury. The Multnomah County District Attorney's Office brought forward 23 witnesses and a report from a deputy medical examiner. The grand jury indicted Taylor with one count of second-degree manslaughter and second-degree assault. According to court documents, Taylor acted recklessly and caused the death of Mancuso, essentially saying he should have known better. But other court documents filed claim that Taylor was simply acting in self-defense. Taylor entered a not guilty plea. His bail has been set at $500,000, but there is a chance that he could be released depending on a court-ordered interview with Multnomah County staff. Reporting in downtown, I'm Brent Weisberg, Coin 6 News.